The effects of acid rain can be seen in the lab by reacting calcium carbonate with acid. In the lab, you may have got a sample of calcium carbonate, maybe a bit of chalk, a bit of limestone, drop some hydrochloric acid on there and see it fizz. This is going to be forming calcium chloride, water and carbon dioxide. When we have acid rain, a slightly different salt is formed, that is calcium sulfate, because acid rain is just very, very weak sulfuric acid. So again, we are going to have calcium carbonate, sulfuric acid, turning into calcium sulfate, carbon dioxide and water. So here we go, we're looking at the reaction of calcium carbonate and an acid. In here, I just have some marble chips. I'm just going to pour in some hydrochloric acid and I just want you to watch what happens. Straight away, we can see that there is fizzing going on and a gas is being produced. The calcium carbonate is turning into calcium chloride, carbon dioxide and water. This is a really, really quick reaction that goes on. If we're going to be using calcium carbonate to make buildings, this is the reaction that would happen if acid rain occurred. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any new videos. Check out my website, bromoscreen.com, for any new videos, all the videos sorted by exam board, the blog, and any um, extra advice there is. Any comments, questions, topic requests, or um, corrections below.